Collaboration at Keesler Air Force Base Medical Center is delivering better cancer care. Doctors in the radiation therapy and dental departments say a new device creates a safer, more effective cancer treatment. Amber Spradley shows us the equipment in action. One creative idea, two squadrons teamwork, and 3D printing. That's the blueprint for Keesler's latest medical innovation. We have a conventional workflow that we've relied on in the past, and we have found that this digital solution surpasses. It was a game changer. Dr. Jason Hayes is the medical director of radiation oncology. He treats about 110 patients with radiation every year, but he says those treatments have only been about 90% effective. That's not perfect, and even if we tape this down, there's air gaps between the skin and that can interfere with the dose that we can deliver to the patient. He took this to the 81st Dental Squadron. I can make any kind of shape, any kind of surface needed. It. It's gotta be able to be removed and put back on the patient uh, every day um, in exactly the same position. And he said, I think we can do that. And that's just what dental lab technician Dr. Stefan DeReese did. With his software typically used to produce teeth, he's now developing custom-made devices for each patient, all starting with a digital scan. I create the bolus by tricking the computer into making something else. The unique mold now reducing patients' radiation exposure, making the cancer treatment safer, more precise, and more effective. It's humbling in a way to know that you're doing something more than what you're expected to. Knowing that you are able to help someone pretty much in a life-saving way. Keesler Air Force Base, Amber Spradley, WLOX News Now. And Keesler medical officials say that with the new custom mold, radiation treatment is showing 97% accuracy. And that's about 7% more effective than with the conventional device, they say. And they're now working to share their innovative ideas with other medical facilities.